Good day everyone, we're back. So we are now in episode 37 of our um, amazing game tactical RPG Unicorn Overlord. So we are now done with this region, Drakenhold, and now we are going to this region. Okay, so the first main quest here is the winding wood and I'm going to process or this overworld quest because I don't have enough um, woods to fix the bridge and for that the reefer carving is inaccessible okay so and this one needs to have a traversal of 50% so we can um, we can submit our quest here to a old man okay so a new beginning a new region so the winding wood so if you enjoy watching this video please don't hesitate to like and comment down below please chat i mean please subscribe to this channel it will be a huge help for me as a new streamer so here we are new region here i come i also open this region because we did the stage here level 25 i don't know if we can go here yes if it's possible since this is an open world game maybe we can but uh if we want the story we want to follow the story um joseph want us to go here after we we rescue uh, Veronica is that her name? I cannot remember okay so after rescuing the princess here she, he told us that we can now go to this um, region and now we're done with this so let's go to this one okay so let's go It's somewhere here. Um, for us lies the winding wood, a vast twisting forest through which only elves are able to navigate. Fortunately, Lady Yana is good to lend us her wisdom traversing it. Okay. As the elder witch of the swamp, the elves trust me like they do few others. If it's passage to Halheim, you're after, I'd be glad to show the way. Okay. Let's see. Just past this thicket ahead, and we'll have made it through. My thanks, Yana. We would have wandered this wood for weeks without your aid. Come, we should hurry. Oh. Lady Rosalinda? What are you doing here by yourself? You've arrived with some timing, Sarimet Yana. I was actually hoping to entreat your aid. An acquaintance of yours, I presume? This is Lady Rosalinda. An elf. Elder sister to the Taranas of the Elves. Taranas of the elf. And the boy is? Prince Elaine, heir to Cornea's throne and commander of their Liberation Army. Elaine, then. I see. Why have you come to Elheim? To breathe life into a revelation I was granted in Cornea's sanctuary. I was bade to meet with your Taranas. Then I fear your travels are in vain. Altalinda is captive. Held prisoner in Castle Lower Hall ever since our defeat at Zenoira's Blade. Our people have fought for moons unending in order to win back her freedom. Let us help. But our forces dwindle with every passing day. We will never succeed without help. Which is why you came looking for me. If I may, how was Zenoira able to breach the confounding defenses of the Winding Wood? By the hand of Sadimet Alcina. Uh, that can't be. Alcina was a sorceress of great renown, 
and my esteemed master in the art of spellcraft. She was a trusted advisor to your grandfather, King Gerard, of two generations past. A faithful ally to the crown, then. She must surely be under Zenoira's control to have turned against us so... Now, you seek the Tudinos, while I seek an army. Two notes in the same melody. What say we sing this hymn together? Okay, sure. You'd truly be willing to join us? We march to vanquish Galerius and free all nations of Fevrith alike. Should you truly extend such a generous offer, we would gladly accept it. Come, I'll introduce you to the others. <laughs> You're a bigger dreamer than you look. Thank you, Elaine. I'd like that very much. This is the Elheim. We made it through the winding woods unscathed. My prince, let's press onwards. As I mentioned in the forest, I mean to fight as a part of your army. So please lend me your aid in liberating Elheim. Okay, so we have a new unit. It's an elf. Let's see. A level 10 spear users freezing trust uh, primus edge okay what's this golem carving okay Uh, resistance lives on so let's do that level 15 elven archer druid and griffin master what's the difference between a normal archer with elven archer let's see the resistance lives on Honolin, even our final attempt ends in failure Live in Lago, sir Ter Rosalinda approaches with an envoy of soldiers uh, by the stars my lady calm yourself please I'm perfectly unharmed <sighs> oh Anita Oh, you're here as well, Sodomet. It's been a while, Lin. It has been far too long indeed. My lady, I wouldn't dare pass up willing reinforcements, but the state of the enemy is but a teal away. Nothing is decided until the final blow is struck. And you are? My name is Elaine, commander of the Cornian Liberation. We've come to aid your resistance at Rosalinda's request. And I am Lin Alagos, of said resistance. Firm as your voice may ring, our defeat is unavoidable. Few able soldiers remain in this hold, and fewer still are willing to fight. Then allow me to reframe the matter. My army will push forth to the enemy stronghold. All I ask of you is to cover our rear. <laughs> you will charge ahead knowing well the severity of our struggles? This is a bold proclamation, sir, but not one I'm willing to overlook, even if we fall in the process. Lenny Lagus. Okay, so what's our agenda for today? All my efforts to avoid such this and madness rattles, yet here we are, well and truly surrounded. Mm, thankfully our ballistae are still in working in working order, though we lack the number necessary to operate them. I entreat you Knights of Liberation, lend us your aid. Lenny Lagos here is killed both in attacking with a bow and healing allies, that and his key member in the fight to reclaim our homeland. Command him well and he'll see your trust repaid in kind. Elven archers are masters of the bow, highly skilled at supporting allies from the back. Uh, 
forward men don't let single one of them live alive. Oh, not so many. Uh, liberation command post captured. Defeat Denise. So we don't need to defeat the units, enemy units above. Ooh, maybe we can try, I guess. Another step on the lock until my dying breath. I advance. I trust in your judgment. Understood. In service of the royal, I'll not fail you. By your word. Be preserved. Your orders? Very well. I have arrived. What would you ask of me next? Temporary retreat. Face your demise! to any challenge. No. No. Be gone to fall on the lid. What would you ask? Always up for a fight. Uh. Try and keep up. They never stood a chance. Orders? It shall be done. I wonder if I'm stronger than Lady Oclis. If you want me, then have me! Okay, that's it. So, oh. that for the first battle in Alhai. <coughs> Your warriors are even more skilled than the rumors claim. Then allow us to show our compassion as well. Might we assist you in tending to the wounded? Your kindness is touching, truly. As you can well see, that battle was a grave one indeed. Most of our ranks lie decimated. While those who lived will never again stand on the front lines. My squadron among them. I understand. We'll send our healers to their aid at once. Speaking of the battle, though, 
It seemed the enemy we faced were lacking the calm demeanor of a formal army. Trained soldiers are in short supply when you're invading as many nations as Inoira is. The whispers of the trees say they're prioritizing raw manpower over any kind of quality or skill. While orderly rule and the safety of the locals seem to be even lower priorities still. As things stand, I can offer no peace to the countless lives that have fallen before the steel of these oppressors. Instead, I'll carry their spirits with me until the day I finally purge Zenoira from our home. And I would like to do so by your side. Let's save our progress. Maybe we can do another battle. Or we can just... Um... Explore, I guess? I was certain this day would see our resistance falter, and it will have indeed done so, if not for your efforts. It is that I shall repay with my life. Now come, let us topple Zenoria's grasp in this land together. Okay, so Lina Lagos joined the Liberation Army. So he is a... Um... Elven Archer. Okay, they can cure. Uh huh. Can we promote them? Can we? Or we cannot? No, I think they're already promoted unit. Yes, I think they are. Because they have two action points and passive points. Okay, so let's battle this unit. What the quest you got there? Oh, we already completed this because it needs to promote a unit. And we already did. Um, let's hire some Elven Archer. Okay, we... let's explore before we end this video. So if you're still watching this video, thank you. Don't hesitate. Please to subscribe and bring what you seek among my like the video. Comment down below. Okay. So, what provisioner? Human. Let me know what strikes your fancy. Uh, nothing good there. But they're dropping old woman. That's an old woman. This is cemetery. Pardon the intrusion, my prince, but would you permit me to visit this cemetery? Due to her advanced age, our head cleric, Mother Lady Leah. Lilia asked me to offer prayers to the fallen spirit in her stead. Okay, so the cemeteries of Helheim is triggered. We need to offer prayers to cemeteries in Helheim, like we did in Cornea. And on Drakenhold, let's see what we can get here. El Groblamba. Um, another El Groblamba. Uh, okay, the Battle of Satama. Okay, nothing to explore. Oh, we need unsolid timber. Okay, so I'm going somewhere here. Panyaveta town. Maybe we can have a liberation quest besides the 
what's this? Okay, so another sigil. Okay, so we have two liberation quests and that will be our next episode. So thank you for watching and see you on the next video shortly. Goodbye.